I started my first business when, you know, when I was 28, I think. And it was a business about helping people connect and communicate more effectively. So I used to go into ad agencies and help them pitch for business. That was my business idea. You know, it was, it, it's, it's hardly a lapel grabber now, but at the time it was quite an interesting idea to go in and help them pitch using theatrical device, Sandra. So I was like the Sam Mendes to their Kevin Spacey and Annette Benning. I'd go in and say, you hand to him. Oh, you're fabulous. You say that first. I can't hear the message. You're burying the message. Bring them in. All that stuff. And in the process of that, realized, when I was a wee girl, my dad asked me, um, what do you want to be, Hen, when you grow up, as all our daddies do, right? So I'm like six, and he's like, what do you want to be when you grow up, Hen? I said, a teacher. He said, oh, Hen. He said, set your sights a wee bit higher than that. Turns out I was right. And the day I taught my first class, Sandra, that was the moment. I went back, you know, you think about it, all the mummies in the room and all the daddies in the room. When you, when you meet your baby for the first time, right? So you've been carrying this wee baby your, your whole life. And then you finally meet him or her. And they plop it on your belly. And you look into those wee eyes. You've been so dying to meet them. And you hold that wee head in your hands and you look in your eyes them for the first time. Think of what you say to your baby. The first thing you say to your baby. Mine was as unpremeditated as yours, I'm sure. But most of the mummies I ask say some version of what I said. Hello, you. Right? All the mummies don't recognize that. Oh, it's you. And it's not only the welcoming hello, it's you. It's you I was waiting for. And you know when I got into my car after teaching that class that day? I looked in the rearview mirror and that's what I said. I didn't say it out loud because I'm not mad, okay? <laughs> but there was a recognition. I knew you were coming, I just didn't know when. <laughs>